hat-trick has been so impressive for St Kilda this season on the last line of defence. Unfortunately for the Blues, there's Press Barkas to try and tidy it up. She links up with Hosking. And Sarah looks for an option on the inside, finds Egan. Al Downey will take this ruck contest against Ree Watt. Got the fierce, dangerous spot. Hosking, can she finish? Yes, she can. Goal apiece at Icon Park. That was great work by Sarah Hosking. Opportunistic, found the hole and a great finish in front of goal. One thing about the Blues that's impressive, Abs, they're becoming more predictable of each other, aren't they, the more this group plays together? They really are, and it's a great thing there to see to see Sarah finish off with a goal. But... Her up and take her down. Handball came out, umpire said play on. Phillips, she's gang tackled and taken down as well. And the umpire will say holding the ball. Throws herself in every contest, does the veteran, and she drills it inside 50. Off the hands of Harris. Lovely crumb from Vessio. Hosking for a second. Beautiful finish from the Blues. Once again, quality football. Front and centre crumb. Player predictable coming past for the overlap handball. And Hosking the finish. Brilliant work once again by Sarah Hosking. As we said in her first goal of the game, she hangs off the contest. She she recognises that if the ball comes out the side, um, she's there ready to go and to slot through the goal. She'd only kicked three goals in her 27 AFL games, AFLW games before tonight. She's got two in one quarter. <laughs> She's got two in one quarter, Jason. Didn't she love it? Look at this celebration with her and Darcy Vessio. Slow to get up there is Kelly O'Neill for the Saints. Handball off to Mackie back in the side this week. Her handball went searching. It was cut off by Sarah Hosking. Gives it off to Dylan. She'll go wide towards Greiser. Wilson and going back with courage with Sarah Hosking. She'll switch laterally to Lalawifi. It's to kick her first goal for the Saints. She floats it across the face. It might work out. It'll drop short to the front of the goal square. Egan's there for the Blues. Greiser lurking as well. Greiser picks it up. Gets boot to ball. Dangerous position. Mackie might get another chance. Play on. It was touched off the boot. Smothered off her hands. Dalton will feed it out. Here's a chance for Hosking. Tries to step around Johnson. Puts it into the path of Stevens. And win it. Moody with strength tries to barge out and does. Hosking. Dalton again with quick hands, nicely read by Guttridge, runs into Hosking, Greiser goes off the deck. Wilson, nicely done over the top from McDonald to force a contest. Hosking, down to Press Farkas, who's rolled and tackled, kicks it wide for space. Drennan versus Sarah Hosking, Drennan takes it, Hosking takes her, Drennan manages to get it to boot to ball. Zenos, well, got to Phillips, saved the day for the Saints, it might be coming back. Hosking's involved, Sarah. Tackled by Drennan. But it's that Dalton to Walker link up, isn't it, that we're all loving so much. These are two women that are still learning the game, but they are already dominating through the centre of the ground. So it's really exciting for Carlton fans to see just the run and carry. Chaos for the opposition, and that's what they do when they can break a line and get out into space and run. Hosking taken down high. Sarah Hosking will get the free kick, her 11th touch coming up. When you've got... Walker and Dalton and G, all with lightning speed. 